Hey guys, Brandon Lewis here from Better Computing Design, and this week you're watching DevKit Weekly with the Thundercom TurboX AI Kit. The Thundercom Turbo X AI kit comes in this pretty sleek looking enclosure and if you weren't careful you might think that it was a home router or something, um, especially since it's got these three uh, LED indicators here on the front which um, notify you that the device is powered on, um, that it's connected to a network, and then this third one here is actually an indication that the camera, this integrated 8 megapixel camera, is working. So as you can imagine, with an integrated 8 megapixel camera um, in an AI kit, this is really targeted at applications like facial recognition, object detection, object recognition, etc. And we're about to tell you why. So the Turbo X AI kit is based on a Thundercom uh, system on module, which itself is based around the Qualcomm SDA845 SoC, which is a heterogeneous system on chip that packs a ton of processing power. So you got eight CPU cores on there, you got a GPU, um, you also have Hexagon DSPs, and all of these come together to give you more than 450 gigaflops worth of performance, which as you know, is probably something you're gonna be taking lots of advantage of if you're running uh, pretty sophisticated AI algorithms on the device itself. But in addition to all of that compute power that's designed to help uh, run the AI inferencing algorithms themselves, uh, there's also a dual 14-bit uh, Qualcomm Spectra uh, image signal processor um, inside here that allows you to process 4K video at up to 60 frames per second, which has some help from some embedded hardware accelerators that are used for, for video encode and decode. Um, some of the standards are HVC, HEVC, uh, HLG, etc. So in order to access all of the input data that's coming in, perhaps through this camera, um, there is a ton of memory and storage available on the Turbo X AI kit. So for example, there are eight gigabytes of uh, low power DDR4, as well as 64 gigabytes of universal flash storage, as well as an SD card slot. So there's lots of memory and storage there, and it allows all of those cores um, and that image signal, signal processing pipeline to quickly access data um, on the device and keep things moving through so that you can have a video stream coming in and then apply AI algorithms to it all without having to leave this system. Now flipping it around, um, you can also see that there's a ton of other interfaces on here, uh, notably uh, three USB uh, 3.0 ports, which can be used to drive additional cameras if you'd like. So with all the processing performance and the image signal processing performance that you get with the Turbo X AI kit, um, you can have not only the camera here on the front, but a multi-camera setup that's able to do some really pretty sophisticated um, image recognition, object detection, et cetera. Of course, zooming in a little bit, you can see uh, that there's a USB Type-C port here, which can also be used to drive a display. Um, HDMI uh, support uh, is also down here in a micro HDMI. Um, there's a gigabit Ethernet port, and then also you would do your debugging through this micro uh, USB. Any audio files out there will be happy um, to know that there is an integrated uh, microphone, stereo, and there's also this headset out port. So it's possible that if you want to do some speech rack, voice rack, natural language processing, that this kit could help get you on your way. And the last thing from a hardware perspective is that on the Turbo X, there's also a Qualcomm Wi-Fi Bluetooth combo chip, um, which supports uh, 802.11abg and AC, you know, the, the, the alphabet soup that is uh, Wi-Fi standards now, 2.4 and 5 gigahertz, as well as Bluetooth 5 uh, with support for Bluetooth low energy. So if you notice uh, that this uh, little LED when you plug it in is on, means good things, you're probably wirelessly connected to a network. But what really probably sets the Turbo X AI kit apart from other solutions that are available on the market right now is, of course, software. 
So the Qualcomm AI engine um, is supported by the Turbo X AI kit. And what that does is it integrates the Qualcomm Neural Processing SDK um, and Android NN APIs. So you can really get started quickly um, developing algorithms natively for this platform that are optimized for uh, the Qualcomm SoC that we mentioned previously. So as part of the Qualcomm AI engine, you'll also find um, some pre-trained algorithms that are in there, um, some demo application code, and other tools and resources that can help you really on-ramp your AI algorithm development. And uh, the AI engine is compatible with uh, model training frameworks like CAFE, TensorFlow, and others that mesh well with the Onyx interchange format. And finally, other app development tools, cloud services, a forum, um, and a bunch of other stuff that may assist you in the creation of an end-to-end -end AI um, application are available uh, for the Turbo X AI kit through resources on 45smart.com. So all in all, the Thundercom Turbo X AI kit is pretty cool um, and it's pretty comprehensive in terms of an all-in-one solution to help you get started prototyping some actually pretty advanced AI types of applications. Um, everything you need is right here. Um, it supports uh, all the operating temperature ranges you normally think and it's you know pretty compact. Uh, compact. You know, I've got some big hands and uh, you know this could fit nicely within them. Uh, you can get one of these for $799 from Thundercom um, and also part, it's also part of the Qualcomm Developer Network uh, so you may be able to find um, other places to acquire the kit there. But of course this is DevKit Weekly and one of the cool things about DevKit Weekly is that we are going to be raffling off this kit uh, for absolutely free to one of you who fills out the form which is linked in the description below. So you can go from $799 to $0 by just simply uh, filling out the kit to, uh, or filling out the raffle to enter uh, a drawing for this sucker here and hopefully um, this can be yours. All in all, I'd say that the Thundercom Turbo X AI kit is a pretty awesome way to get started uh, quickly prototyping AI algorithms for some of the hottest new fields of engineering, um, electronics engineering, uh, facial recognition, object detection, etc. And of course, I mentioned some of those audio inputs too, which may help you add a little bit of flavor to whatever you're going to be designing. Um, if you'd like to find out more about the kit, you can uh, go to the Thundercom website, which is www.thundercom2msthere.com. Thanks for watching DevKit Weekly, and I look forward to seeing you next week.